On June 24, 2022, the U.S. Supreme Court overturned Roe v. Wade. I would never have thought years ago that we would be back at this um, position, considering that we worked so hard and long to get the protections that we've had. With the court case Dobbs versus Jackson Women's Health Organization. Now, two years later, many still feel strongly about the outcome. Well, it's definitely had an impact. It's not been a good one. I'd, I'd like to see us move in a better direction. North Carolina's current abortion law, quote, bans abortion after 12 weeks of pregnancy in most circumstances. However, Kidwell says it actually has increased abortions. So we've actually now become a destination state for abortion and we've seen a massive increase in the number of abortions being performed. The North Carolina Senate Democratic Caucus met Monday afternoon to discuss the law's impact on the state. I pray the press conference will educate people on what has happened, but the only way we're going to change it is through these November elections. As the conversation continues, the topic is on the minds of many heading to the polls in November.